Under its eighth director, Vice Admiral Frank Whitworth, the National Geospatial Intelligence Agency is zeroing in on GEOINT supremacy as its highest priority, and it's deploying technologies like artificial intelligence, digital twins and automation to achieve it. Meet and learn from Whitworth in person at the Potomac Officers Club's 9th Annual Intel Summit on September 21. Andy Green, Executive Vice President of HII and President of the company's Mission Technologies Division, recently accepted his 2023 WASH 100 award during a meeting with Executive Mosaic CEO Jim Garretson. In the first edition of a double installment GovCon expert piece, Brooks Consulting International President Chuck Brooks lays out the benefits of the Cybersecurity and Infrastructure Security Agency's latest efforts to educate and arm organizations against cyber threats. Private equity firm Vector Capital has completed its purchase of Riverbed Technology, and named tech industry veteran Dave Donatelli as CEO of the acquired IT company. The National Institutes of Health Information Technology Acquisition and Assessment Center has extended for another six months the Chief Information Officer Solutions and Partners III contract, as the agency works to take corrective action following protests to the recompete of its IT procurement vehicle. HII's Mission Technologies Division will continue to support cloud enterprise IT migration efforts at the National Geospatial Intelligence Agency, under a recompeted contract worth $84 million. Christopher Ronsky, Vice President of Human Resources at Lockheed Martin's Rotary and Mission Systems Business, will succeed the retiring Greg Carroll as Senior VP and Chief HR Officer of the corporation. Four U.S. lawmakers have urged the Department of Defense to strengthen its review process for mergers and acquisitions and be more transparent with the public about the findings of its reviews of such transactions while ensuring the need to safeguard national security and confidential business information. 2023 Microelectronics Forum on July 25, 2023. Visit executivebiz.com events. David Klein, a 23-year veteran of Lockheed Martin, has joined General Dynamics Information Technology Business as Vice President of Strategic Capture. Former Lido's executive Helen Solne has been appointed Vice President of Proposal Operations at Eclipse Technologies, an Arlington Capital Partners portfolio company that offers cyber and signals intelligence engineering services to the government sector.